Cell phone video shows a Chicago police officer on the ground waiting for an ambulance to arrive after he was run over by his own squad car when a woman stole it from him. It was horrific. It was, it's, it's sad what happened to the officer. Uh, the young lady, whoever she was, she was completely naked. Reuben Dunning saw the situation unfold from his apartment on the corner of Jackson Boulevard and Costner. He says the officer stopped to help the lady who was lying in the street. Well, he had got out the car and see what was going on with her because she was just completely naked. And she ran and took and jumped in his car and ran him over. The woman fled in the squad car on the Eisenhower Expressway. She ended up crashing into about five vehicles on Harrison and Damon. Nicholas Ramsey was on his way to work as a resident in the Rush emergency room when his car was hit. And then all of a sudden I just got hit by a, a police car. Um, the police car hit several cars and then stopped right in front of me and then out of the police car, I saw some woman jump out and run. Ramsey says the woman was tackled and taken into custody. As detectives worked the scene where the officer was injured, the woman's family showed up looking for answers. Her mother, who did not want to be identified, says her 34-year-old daughter called her several times early this morning asking for help. Because she was saying, Mom, come and get me, please, 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 please. She's been raped and she sounds too good. I feel like I've been drugged. And I said, where are you at? She said, I don't know, I don't know. After her arrest, the female suspect was taken to a hospital for a psychological evaluation. The officer was taken here to Strozier Hospital. He's been treated for a laceration to the head and injuries to his legs. At Strozier Hospital, Sarah Schulte, ABC7 Eyewitness News.